What's up, guys? My name is Miles. And my name is Fez. And this is The Commodity. And today we are reacting to the top 10 richest provinces in the Philippines 2021. We reacted to top 10 richest cities in the Philippines, uh, which was recommended in our Discord. This was recommended also on our Discord. If you guys want to recommend videos like this, click the link in the description. Hop on over to our video suggestion box and you can throw a link in there as well. Uh, I'm super excited to check this out. I was very intrigued by the last one um i mean they in my opinion they were pretty rich cities <laughs> i mean right and they weren't crazy rich compared to you know converting it to other countries but for the philippines they they were wealthy cities see and i i'll be honest i don't have any like Anything i have to nothing compare to, to compare it to so right. as far as i'm concerned yeah they're loaded but I mean, compared oh, to like that, with Tokyo all that Marco school. Like, oh, huh? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's funny how mixed the comments are on that video. The Marco's gold. Yeah, video. like yeah, some you people guys are like, for, like it yeah, was like 50 all, 50. Yeah, it's all true. It's all fake. Or, and I I know there's there's people out there that want it to be true. Yeah, of course. and I want it to be true. I, I want it to be true. So that would change everything. So I believe in it. Entire land. I believe in it because it. I mean, it wouldn't just. I have hopes that it's a thing. Like, it's legit. That's what I... Mean. I mean, if it is, they're the richest country. Yeah. By far. I mean... Yeah. Hypothetically, yeah. If if that... If they're the golds out there. Yeah. You guys had... It was like a 50-50 mix. Some of you believed it. Some of you didn't. And I thought that was awesome. Yeah. That... Uh, that, that, that there was a division in that. Yeah. Not, not in a bad way. Like, yeah. nobody's, like, arguing over it. They're just like, yeah, it's fake. Or, yeah, it's 100% real. Or... Um, we'll find out in the future and hopefully it is. So it, it's yeah. been really mixed. And I think that's actually really cool because it's, it's one of our first videos that nobody's like, Oh, it, it is, it is. Or, yeah. Oh, if it's, yeah. It was the first don't. video I think we've had that half of the comment section did not agree with the other half. Yeah. So, but again, it, it wasn't, there was no fighting. It right. just was different beliefs or different, uh, um, like, I feel like some people are like, they're not holding their breath. Yeah. They're like, if it happens, it happens great. But if it doesn't, I didn't, we didn't stack our chips against this. Right. So we didn't lose anything. We only have something to gain, which yeah. I think is a good way to look at it. Guys, before we hop into this video, if you would go ahead and give this video a like, it definitely helps us uh, in getting this video out to more people. Also, if you would, go ahead and click that subscribe button and the bell notification if you guys want to receive notifications on our next videos coming out. Also, if you'd like to help support the channel even more, you can click that join button down below this video. And with that being said, let's hop in. Let's do it. Top 10 richest provinces. For the sixth consecutive year, Cebu remained the richest province in the Philippines, according to the latest Commission on Audit, or COA, report. Cebu has a total of 196.19 billion pesos worth of properties and cash worth 7.7 .7 billion pesos. And what I did learn, especially, is that they use centavos. Yeah. So it's kind of cool because they all speak English. Not necessarily all of them speak Spanish, but they're using Spanish for pesos and centavos. Mm -hmm. So I thought that was really cool. It's a perfect pesos place for you. For a total assets yeah. of 203.9 billion It's almost Tex-Mex. Yeah. Or to Spanglish. completing the top 10 richest provinces, here's the list. Ten. I was surprised we didn't get monetized, demonetized for this music on the last one. Yeah. Ilo Ilo. Yeah, I left it on there because the there was The province is located in the center of the Philippines archipelago, Ilo. nicknamed the heart of the nation. Its capital is Ilo Ilo City with a total Ilo assets Ilo. of 13.034 billion pesos, making it the 10th richest province in the country. So are provinces like states? I Nine. believe so. Because they have their own capitals. Yeah. Palawan. Palawan is an archipelagic province in the region of Mimaropa. Its capital is Puerto Princesa. The largest province in the country has a total assets of 13.036 billion pesos. I'd spend all my time on that little sandbar. What's up, ladies? Hello. That's a really cool monument. Yeah, that's right. really cool. Would you call it a monument? I mean, yeah. Uh, a memorial. It's like a memorial historical monument. Yeah. 
That's really cool. I think that should be something that's over on like uh the where they did D Day, um the beach of Normandy. Yeah, that that is very cool. Yeah, that's super cool. Credit total assets of thirteen point five billion pesos. That it is, is a province in the Philippines located in the eastern Visayas region, occupying the northern three quarters of Leyte Island. Its capital is the city of Tacloban. Tacloban. Seven. Negros Occidental. Negros Occidental. Located in the western Visayas region. Its capital is the city of Bacolod. Known as the Sugar Bowl of the Philippines, Negros Occidental produces more than half the nation's sugar output. Wow. It has that's a total crazy. assets of 15.9 billion pesos. Sugar is a huge deal in the United States. So, <laughs> obviously. <laughs> Look at us. So, uh, with that being said, I started a diet today. Catch me in a month. Let's we'll see uh, if you stick to it because we've said that a lot lately. Um,. Yeah, sugar is a huge thing in the United States if you look at our obesity rates. So, uh, if if Texas was the biggest producer of sugar, Texas would be the richest state. We're the second richest in the U.S. We'd be the richest if we were the biggest producer of sugar. Mississippi, if Mississippi was the biggest producer of sugar, not only would Mississippi be still the most obese state forever... But, <laughs> but it would also be the, be the richest. richest. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm surprised this isn't Please. ranked higher. Yeah. Surigao del Norte. Surigao del Norte. The province has a total assets of 16.6 billion pesos. That's cool capital. Building. Located in the Caraga region of Mindanao. Its capital is Surigao City. The province comprises two major islands. Chirgao and Bucas Grande in the Philippine Sea. The landscape Five. in Asia is so beautiful. Bukidnon. Bukidnon. The fifth wealthiest province of the country is Bukidnon with 18.2 billion pesos. It's a landlocked province in the Philippines located in the northern Mindanao region. Its capital is the city of Malaybalay. Malaybalay. Four. Say that. How, how do they say it? Male Bale. Male Bale. Is that fun to say? Not really. Male Bale. I'm not going to lie. I'm just, no. <laughs> Male It's like, it's like. Francisco. That's it's like saying Mali in Australia. Male. Male. Male Bale. Hello, Male. <laughs> the Val de Oro. Hello, Gavna. Wait, that's British. The province was formerly Mole. known as Val de Oro. Pronounce, I didn't Bale. pronounce that one. Bale. Four. The Val de Oro. Deval de Oro. The province was formerly known as Compostela Valley with a total assets of 20.09 billion pesos. I like this downtown vibe it looks Located like. Located in the Davao region in Mindanao. Oh, check that out. That, that is, is beautiful. What is that? What kind of tree? These look like trees or, or shrubs. Shrubs. Because I think, you know, I mean, the trees are way taller because they you got one over here that's a shrub on the bottom of these trees over here. You see this? Yeah. Or maybe it's just like a small flower bush. I don't know. It's beautiful either way. It, it's, it's really cool. It's hard for you guys to probably tell us from a small screen what this is. But if you know for a fact what this is, let us know in the comments. Well, maybe it's not it's a small screen. What if they're watching on a big screen? Three. Rizal. 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 That is dope. In the Did you see what they were standing on? Oh, it's like a hell net. Hell no. Rizal. It's a province in the Philippines located in the Calabarzon region in Luzon. That's beautiful. That is its super cool. Its capital is the city of Antipolo. It is about 16 kilometers east of Manila. That's awesome to see. It has yeah. a total assets of 20.2 billion Renewable pesos. Renewable energy. So what this place, what these, okay, so what I've noticed a lot, because I know that they had said this, um, that when the Spanish was uh, controlling the country, they did a lot, what do they call them? Um missions they did a lot of missions and this mm -hmm. looks circa that time because if you go to san antonio there's i believe seven major missions that were done by the conquistadors or the spaniards and that's one thing that i've noticed that have a lot of similarities is in san antonio which is where i'm born and uh the philippines they have very very similar san antonio san antonio 
San Anto. But yeah, they have a lot of uh, similarities. San Antonio. San Antonio. Honda, Toyota. And I think that's a Honda too. Two. Batangas. Batangas. With 20.7 billion pesos, the second richest province in the country. That's dope. Located in the Calabarzon region in Luzon. Its capital is the city of Batangas and is bordered by the provinces of Cavite and Laguna to the north. And is that like a... Looks like homes. Are those homes or would those be like Airbnbs maybe? Or... I mean, obviously it's not... It's not like a resort. It, it might be. It might be a resort. Yeah. I don't know. It, it would. It'd be a very hard to. Like a, a small resort. Yeah. It'd be hard to kind of, you know. It'd probably be sold out all the time. Yeah. <laughs> That's really cool though. I would love to. This is kind of like the resort that we saw in Malaysia. Yeah. The, um, uh, the hibiscus. Hibiscus. Yeah. yeah. No, this, this. When I go to any of these places, one thing I do want to do eventually is stay in something like this. Yeah. Because oh, that's an experience on its own. Yeah, it's beautiful. On Waking east. up on top of the water. One. Cebu, Cebu City. The richest province in the Philippines is Cebu, with 203.9 billion pesos. Located in the central Visayas region. It's a drastic difference from its the Its capital others. is Cebu City, the Queen City of the South. The oldest city and first capital of the Philippines, which is politically independent from the That's provincial dope. government. There's the blue building. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> That's an all awesome those, video. All those blue buildings. These, uh, this channel is a very good channel, guys. If if y'all enjoyed their video, go ahead and subscribe to them. Uh, Link will be down in the description. Yeah, I mean, it, so this is the same channel that, that did the top 10 richest cities. Um, okay. I and I and I see top ten most dangerous roads in the Philippines, top ten most military power in Asia. Have we covered their military? Not top. No, I don't think we've done Philippines military. We've done it for the Have for we? Singapore. We've done it for Malaysia, and we've done it for Indonesia. How many videos we have? We got like two hundred and something videos now, right? That we've done today. We're putting out number two hundred and. 31 so 30? forgive us if we forget if we've done a video yeah we've done we're putting out two a day so we can we can try and hit everybody because i mean we've we've got so many countries that we've built relationships in and and we don't mm -hmm. want to feel like we're letting anybody down so we're trying to hit everybody as much as we can and hit all of these uh recommendations and so forgive us if yeah. we've done Philippines military and can't remember. I don't remember. I, I don't really, think we have. I don't think we have either. We need to take a look at that. Guys, if you're still watching right now, comment in the, uh, put in the comment section below if you would like us to watch a uh, military video about the Philippines and react to it. Uh, yeah, just let yeah, us I mean, know. If you guys are interested in that, let us know. All right, guys, if you're still, still watching, that means you enjoy us. Uh, please give us a like on this video. Please subscribe. Hit the bell notification for our future videos. And of course, if you want to join our membership program, hit the join button. That'll help us out directly. And with that being said, my name is Miles. And my name is Fez. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace out.